Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I have not made this recipe before, but it's like a healthier mayo. So right now I am doing a meal plan where you use containers, here's some of them. And so you don't count calories. I found in the past that counting calories did not work for me because I'd be like halfway through the day and I didn't have any calories left. So this helps me to be able to do portion control, but also feel like I'm getting enough food throughout the day and helping to fuel my body. So let's get started. We are making the mayo. I also have some tuna and that goes into my red container and I'm having lunch and it's like a light lunch because I'm doing this new time nutrition. Normally it's a little heavier, but spreading things out more throughout the day. I already had uh, my fruit, my strawberries cut up, so I'm making part of my lunch. So for this, you're going to need two tablespoons of cold water. So I have that. I'm gonna start putting stuff in as we go. Two tablespoons of cold water, one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. I have that one. Okay, and then I'm gonna put that in. And then you need a half a teaspoon of sea salt or Himalayan salt. I'm gonna use Himalayan. I'm not gonna measure it, I just I'm gonna put some in. Same thing, another fourth of a teaspoon of ground pepper. Okay, and then we need sugar and it says we need a teaspoon of, it calls for coconut sugar, but I don't think I have that currently. So I'm just using uh, raw cane sugar right now. It's a brand new one too. So if you've watched some of my previous videos, we just moved, so this is our new kitchen. And so there's some new items that I haven't opened yet. All right, so a teaspoon, make sure I got the right one, a teaspoon of sugar, throw that in. All right, and then onion powder, you need a fourth of a teaspoon. Okay, clean things up here as we go. Again, I'm not gonna really measure it. If you want to measure it, you go for it. I just don't always do that. <laughs> All right, and then two large egg yolks. So I got a bowl. I'm hoping this works. We will see. Okay. Wash my hands off a little bit real fast. Okay. Got the yolks in there. All right, and then the olive oil, we need a fourth of a cup, but we save that for after we've blended everything kind of together here. I don't know if I have a fourth of a cup. Just barely. Okay. Another one. Another brand new one. <laughs> new house. Okay. Finish filling that up. If you guys have ever made like a yummy mayo that you like that seems to be, I guess, healthier, then put down in the comments, let me know. I did make a pesto the other day, which was really good. It was easy. If you'd like that recipe, let me know. All right, so now we need to put it in the blender. And it says just to pulse it a couple times. So it shouldn't take long. Don't be loud, sorry. Alright, and then it says to add the oil little by little. 
So I think because I don't have one that like opens at the top, that's what you're supposed to do is pour it slowly. I'm hoping that if I just do like half and half, it'll work. But we'll see. Pour half. Turn out better if I had the open one. Don't. Well, I think that's it, basically. So, I mean, it's not like the same consistency as mayo. It's pretty liquidy, but I'm putting it in with my tuna. So, to me, that's not a big deal. And I'm hoping it's good. If you uh, need the recipe again, let me know, email me. And I hope to see you guys soon. It does really help out my channel if you subscribe down below and hit the bell for notifications for my next video.